This is the second lecture in the series on the presence of black people in the Bible. This second lecture has been prepared to bring order and clarity to certain matters that have brought confusion to Africa and other parts of the world for centuries. For too long in the history of human civilization, Africans have been stereotyped in negative ways. This has caused African people to continuously grapple with the question of identity and their roles in the development of mankind and salvation. As I've mentioned in the first lecture, that European exodus would not talk about the presence of dark-skinned people in the Bible because this would disaffirm all the works done by Europeans in the arts, science, and religion. The depiction of God and other heavenly beings in Adam as white. The Christian art has thrown Africa into a pool of confusion so that it goes off at a tangent when it comes to spiritual things. Africa has for many centuries worshipped a false European white god who does not exist. A lot of Christian theology and art have globalized this lie and affirmed it through art. As a result of the falsity and dominant biblical art have been made as to believe that the Bible is the product of European intelligence. Thus, millions of African people have no confidence in the Bible. Others have accepted the Bible in the spirit of tolerance and pretense for the purpose of social convenience. The truth has to be told that the Bible is not a product of European intelligence. From the British Museum in London, a unique artifact was found which confirms the primary ethnology and authorship of the Bible. This picture you are looking at comes from the British Museum in London. The title on the top reads Black Israel and on the right hand side the narrative says behold the black people who wrote the Bible. Below this picture is the following statement. It reads thus, the Afro-haired men shown above are ancient Israelites known as Hebrews. The image you are looking at is by the Assyrians who destroyed Israel 3,000 years ago as confirmed by the image. The Hebrews who wrote the Bible were black people. The Bible, among other things, tells the history of the Hebrews. Therefore, what this revelation tells us is that the Bible is the history of black people. We hope that these lectures will bring light and clarity to all those who are seekers of the truth.